We're out here today with Ethan's new drone. It's a Propel Dart 1.0. He had the Atom 1.0 first. We've done that one. It's a smaller drone. This is a bigger drone. We're just kind of getting the works out of it now. Here, you can see, as you can see, you know, we're having trouble getting elevation on it. We've gotten it to the steering around by Ethan chasing it. Somehow he thinks he has to stay close to it. But <laughs> here we're there. But we've got the we've got the steering to it. We don't have the elevation down. It's a very cool thing. You can land on this one. You can hit start, land. It really takes out a lot of the difficulty of getting it going and also landing it. The problem is we found is when you hit start, land, the propeller still goes. So you have to be very careful with it. But other than all, it's a pretty cool drone from what we can tell so far. We haven't figured the stunt thing out yet, but... All right, Easton, try land it with a tree. Easton, you're in that tree. Land it, son. As you can see, it does have some quirks to it. It takes a little bit of time to... We need a bigger open area. We live in townhouses. Hander, it's a VA hospital, and it's... We don't have a big grassy area. We'll probably take it to the park or to a waterfront park in downtown Louisville and do it. We have a lot better chance of getting a better flying experience. As of right now, we're kind of pigeonholed into a small spot so we can't get too crazy with the controls, or hence we might lose it with the trees. What do you think about it, Easton? What do you think is the most difficult part of flying this drone so far? I think the diff most difficult part is like getting all these buttons right here. Show them all the buttons. The speed, stop, lands, collaborate. Cal calibrate. And this just this is blank this and this is and stunt. stunt. And then we got the power in the middle and we got left, right, up and down. We got three channel, fourth channel, and then we got our accelerate XL D cell, left, right, and swivel and pivot. So as you can see, this is a lot more than just a and this is small the drone. drone. Here's the drone this we have drone. right here. It's blue. It's a metallic blue finish. It's got four blades on it, and if you look on the box, this plastic, this this projector right here is not on the box, but it's on the inside, and it's pretty cool, I think, so far we found it, it kind of protects the blades, doesn't it? Yeah. All right. Okay, well, once we, we'll tune back in, once we get a better feel for the gears and all the uh, controls on it.